what up guys welcome back to the channel this is your boy j to the r and in this video i am going to show you how to put your 808s in key in persona studio one artist let's dive right into it so first you want to find your actual 808 that you want to use let's use let's use let's find a simple 808 because some of these 808 that's a nice simple one so once you find the 808 that you want to use for your drums you want to right click it and add it to a new sample one so we're straight we got that done next thing you want to do either you can play it on the keyboard if you're just using your laptop you want to have to you want to draw a note in and you want to loop it the reason why you want to loop it that way you will not have to keep uh, hitting start and, and stop now let's take this off we're gonna go with C so the next thing you want to do is find middle C middle C is normally C4 on an 88 keyboard on an 88 key keyboard and it's C3 on a 61 key if you're using 61 key we're going to use the C3 because C4 is kind of high and C, you already know C3 is going to be closer to it because it's in the lower register and we're talking about 808s so then we're just going to uh, copy that out all right so now come over here and add the tuner plugin to that track and you want to press play and it's going to tell you what note this is so it looks like it's c sharp one so it's even lower than what i just put it so essentially now you know what key is in so then you want to come up here to sample one and where it says root that's your root note you want to change that to c what did i say c sharp one we know that's the root note so now if you play it watch it's going to change boom so now that we know that you may as well bring it on down here to c sharp one and since you know that as well just change the key down here too so that way you'll be uh where you need to be without even having to try So we find our key. Now, if you want to test that out, add you know a sound to the next track. We'll use presence and we'll use uh, piano. That's the easiest on the ears to tell what's in cue. So we'll use a grand piano. And I personally just like to duplicate that particular track and put it down here and then verify everything is straight which it is and see if the sound line up and it did that is how you find the key in persona studio one artist of your 808